how are you? Hi. My name's... How can I help you? My name is Miss T, and, um, I was just telling my doctor that I, I, I've been having some symptoms lately. I haven't been feeling like myself, and, uh, I've been having these pains, and pains in my chest area, and dizziness spells, and I don't know what to do, so I, I came here to get some help. Well, you've come to the right place. Let's go ahead and get your checked in here. Can I have your first and last name, please? Yes, my name is uh, Tasha. Uh, my last name is Tiana. Yeah. Can you spell that for me? Sure. T-I-A. Uh, N is a Nancy and A is an Apple. Gotcha. And your date of birth, Miss Tiana? Uh, my date of birth is, well, a true woman never really tells her age, but <laughs> I'll make an exception. I'm 35 years old. And you don't look a day over 22. Oh, thank you. Okay. okay. Got you all checked in here. Let me go ahead and get the doctor for you. Okay. And we'll be right in with you. Oh. Um. Good morning, Miss T. Uh, my name is Dr. Ta. And how can I help you today? Dr. Takayatsu. I don't know how to describe it to you. Uh, I've been experiencing some symptoms lately, uh, and I don't know. I don't know how to feel. I feel like a, like a damsel in distress. I'm such a healthy person. I don't smoke, and I take my vitamins every day, and I drink my milk. I don't know what to say. I, I'm experiencing some pain, some chest pain. Uh, uh, stuff. I don't know. It's just strange. I've never felt anything like this before. Um, where's the pain? Um, the pain mostly feels like a, I feel like I can't breathe, a shortness of breath, sometimes dizzy, and uh, I don't know what to do. I was wondering if you could help me. Sort of like an angina? Angina, yeah. Angina. Wait, what's angina? <laughs> it's chest pain. Oh, right. Yes, well, that too. Uh, tell me, what can I do? You know what, Miss T, you may be describing symptoms that I'm familiar with. I will have Miss Levine, uh, my, one of my uh, sonographer in the clinic, to have you scan and we will order, uh, we'll order an uh, ultrasound right now and then she'll take care of you. Alright, uh, is, is ultrasound, I mean, is it painful? Absolutely not. All you have to do is you lay down and then uh, follow the sonographer and then she was scan and you go up there. Okay, Dr. Tonkatsu. That makes me feel a little more comfortable and safe. Yes, absolutely. That's why you're here. We'll take care of you. Ms. T, so Dr. Tonkatsu ordered a scan for you today. So we're going to go ahead and do a carpet study. So I'll be scanning your neck area. I'm going to have you lay down for me. And it should take no more than about 15 minutes. All right, that sounds fine. As long as everything's okay, then I'm okay. Absolutely. That's Thank you, Ms. Levine. You. Thank you. Okay, Misty. That's it. We're all set. Is there anything you saw that's not normal? I mean, I want to be healthy. Is there something you saw that doesn't look healthy? Um, well, Misty, actually, I'm going to have these images sent over to your doctor. Um, I'm not allowed to disclose any information, but if there is anything, your doctor will definitely let you know, and he'll get back to you as soon as he can. All right, Miss Levine, thank you. I just want to make sure that the diagnosis is, well, not gonna come out wrong. Not a problem with you, you're in great hands here. Okay. This is the actual CCA shot and this image will be handed over by the sonographer to the doctor in the next video. I have your scans for you. Yeah. Well, 
Oh, this looks uh, pretty bad. I know, I've never seen anything like it. Mm -hmm. This is an early sign of uh, Takeyasu disease. Takeyasu? What is that? Uh, it's actually an attack of major arteries of the body mm -hmm. and uh, aorta, abdominal aorta, subclavian arteries. And pretty much the arteries are getting inflamed and it's all major branches. But she's so young. Yeah, it's actually uh, most of the women who has uh, Asian descent will be the one that's getting impacted by this disease. Well, she did tell me she was like one eighth Japanese. The next part of the film will show Dr. Tak briefly explaining the diagnostics to his patient and possible medication for the patient to fight the Takayatsu arteritis. Thank you. Anesthesia, thank you for your patient it seems that uh, by looking at the scan that we would see a muscle sonographer performed, um, you are in fair first stage of Takayatsu arteritis. And Takayatsu arteritis attacks major vessels in your body, like such as abdominal aorta and subclavian. It is an inflammation of the arteries and its major branches. And it's autoimmune. It affects women, such as your age, and you said you are like 35 years old. That's right. I'll tell you I'm 35, but a true woman doesn't tell her age. <laughs> you know how that is. And your symptoms and ultrasound images describe the first stage of that acid arteritis. Is it serious? It is serious. Well, I don't know what to do, doctor. I mean, you just dropped this bomb on me. You just dropped this... This Hiroshima bomb, this tsunami, it, uh, I feel like Godzilla came into my heart and just ripped my heart out. I feel, I don't know how I feel. It's, Come I mean, Takayatsu arteritis, I, that sounds like something I would eat on a side platter of my sushi plate. Yes. I don't even know what that is. Oh, how do I deal? I don't know what to do. Is there a cure? Yeah, we can give you some medication. And you can even... Uh, have surgery, but it's actually not severe yet. But uh, yeah, we can give you medications. I don't know what to do. Pain. All right. Well, the only thing I can say is, I think I'm. Oh, Miss Levine, I'm so worried. Is there anything you see that... Am I gonna die? I'm concerned. What do you see? What, what is, is that? that? 
Should they 